within Killzone 2, we, there's also a role within the, the players that play more as a team. And the tactician badge really comes into play there because his primary ability is basically deploying spawn points uh, anywhere in the level. You, th you can throw this, uh, this marker anywhere and all your friends can then spawn at that point. So you can really use that as like a, a, a tactical entry point uh, during missions or, or just a place to, to, to meet up with your, with your friends. Secondary ability is, is called the air support. The player has to throw a beacon somewhere in the level and this AI driven uh, flying sentry bot comes flying in and starts patrolling the area where you threw the beacon. So uh, you can use this kind of like as a distraction, you know, to lure players uh, to, to other parts of the level, but you can, you can also use that as, a, as an offensive bit because uh, the bot will start attacking any enemy uh, it sees. So those two abilities combined create a very team-orientated uh, badge on the playstyle. When I play as the tactician, what I really like is that uh, the deployable spawn areas can really change the tide of a battle. Like for instance, uh, you're losing search and destroy, you're, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's never going to work. But I, one time I just managed to run in there and throw a deployable spawn area and all my buddies spawned there. We took over the point, we placed the explosives and we still won the game, which was such an exhilarating uh, rush to, to do. You know, that one little badge ability, that changed the whole game.